welcome back to my YouTube channel. I am currently sat here on the floor, on the play mat with Koopy, say hi. And Leo is having his lunch, as I just showed you. So I've started the vlog a little bit later in the day this time. It's actually like half past 12. We've already had our morning, as I showed you. We've had a really nice morning just chilled out and then my sister-in-law and my niece came over and we went out on the bikes and just had a little play date here at our house. So yeah, we've had a lovely chilled morning. Sorry, I just had to stop there to put Cooper to sleep because he decided that he needed a nap so you can probably hear his white noise buzzing in the background right now. At the start of this video, I showed you a little clip of some jewellery that I have received from Italo. So I've worked with Italo before. I love them as a jewellery brand. I have another pair of earrings that I got with them that I wear a lot. So I was really excited to work with them again and show you guys what I got. So the earrings that I currently have in at the moment are one of the pieces that I got and I love them. They're just really sort of classic, easy to wear earrings which also come with your sterling silver certificate so you know they're the real deal and i just checked and these are actually currently on sale they're only 54 pounds and the thing about italo is they always have extra discounts on offer as well so they've also got 10 percent off any order on top of that at the moment and they've got other deals as well i'm gonna link the italo website in the description box below so you can have a look for yourself now the other piece that i treated myself to was this stunning sapphire ring the thing that really caught my eye about this was the color i went to a wedding two days ago at the weekend and wore a blue dress and this and this just literally went so perfectly i love how extra and extravagant it is <laughs> Perfect for an occasion like a wedding, don't you think? So yeah, I have linked the Italo website in the description box below for you guys so you can have a little look for yourself because they always have the most amazing discounts. And yeah, I always trust their jewellery completely, 100%. So that was the first thing I wanted to show you before I get on with my day. Now, yeah, like I said, it's like one o'clock now and the only thing that I absolutely have to get done today is a food shop that <laughs> I've just attempted to make Leo lunch. I don't even know if you can call it a lunch. Like it was, didn't even have any cheese for his sandwich. So there was chocolate spread in his sandwich. Absolutely shameful lunch because that is how little food we've got in the house. We've got no food in the house. So my main must do thing today is a food shop. Obviously Cooper's just gone off to sleep. So I'm gonna wait for him to wake up and then we're gonna go off to Lidl and we're gonna do our food shop for the week. Um, yeah, the food shop won't be as big as normal because we are on our own this week. In fact, we are pretty much on our own this month. So if you're new, hi. If you're a subscriber, then you probably already know this, but my, my fiance, he, he works away a lot. Um, so a lot of the time is just me and the kids and he can be away sort of Monday to Friday a lot. And it just so happens that August, he's pretty much away Monday to Friday every single week. And we're only really seeing him at the weekends, which can be tough, especially as it's summer holidays. So yeah, kind of every day, just trying to think of something to do. Try and keep Leo busy and entertained and it can be, it can be hard work doing it on your own but I don't know I think the key to solo parenting and being on your own with children is just try and make one plan a day it doesn't have to be extravagant like it's so easy to spend a stupid amount of money in the summer holidays like even if it's just going to the park or like today we had um, Leo's cousin over and we just went out on the bike so I know he's already done you know, something nice today and we'll go, when I go to do the food shop, I might treat him to a magazine or something so that that's something fun for him to do later. I just really try to make sure that we do one thing a day that gets us out of the house and, and that's it. I don't try to apply too much, too much pressure because it's really easy to apply a lot of pressure and to think that you have to do like really fun things constantly, especially when you're on, on your own with the kids. Um, so I just really try and remind myself that I don't have to do that. So yeah, we've had our little play date fun this morning and then the only other thing I wanna get done today is the food shop. 
and then they'll just be a lot of chilling at home. If there's any other mummies out there who are watching this and um, have to spend a lot of time on their own like I do, I get a lot of messages on Instagram from mums like myself and who just want to chat or want just want some advice or just just to know that they're not the only one doing it. My inbox is always open for anyone who just just wants to chat. So yeah, I'm gonna let Koopy have his nap and Leo's just watching his iPad. I'm gonna tidy up, I think, a little bit while that's happening. And then we're gonna head off to Lidl. Exciting. <laughs> Well, the shopping is all done, as you saw, and I took a bottle with me to Lidl as Cooper was due milk while we were there, but actually, he, um, he waited patiently till we got home anyway, but then we literally walked through the door and he was like, ah, wanted his milk immediately, so I just fed him straight away and now i'm just putting away the shopping it's always quite a cheap a cheap shop on a week like this when clint isn't here because really i just get stuff for the kids whatever the kids need and then i just kind of eat whatever um yeah i'm not great when clint's not here like when clint's here i'll like plan the week and what we're eating every evening and when he's not here i'm just like and Leo got a little magazine to keep him busy for the rest of the day. It's a good one too, it's an art magazine. So it came with lots of pencils and pens and stickers and things and it was a good choice, wasn't it Leo? There's lots of things for you to do in here. I'm hoping that's gonna keep him busy for a while because we're not going out again. Like it's half past two now. So most of the day has been taken up. Just need to get Get through the rest of it, get to bedtime, you know how it is. You want me to see the drawings you've done? Yeah. Okay. <gasps> oh my goodness. So, what is it? What am I looking at? So, this is a bum. Okay. This is a football comic. Okay. And this. That's the number, and that's the number, and that's the number, and that's the number. That number two is beautiful. Really perfect. But right, I need to go see Coopy. Have a bit. Leo? Yeah? I need to go see Coopy. Tell me when you want me to come and have a look, okay? Did you ever stop and think? I spend too much time just getting ready Let me be honest I don't know a single thing That I haven't done to make you notice me Let me be real here When I see you my heart starts racing But I don't know if I like this chasing And playing and waiting around It's a shame that my hands start shaking end my vlog on my phone because I don't know what's going on with my camera my memory card is being awful at the moment and just will like hardly hold any any amounts of video I don't know why but as you can see I am done for the day the boys are asleep as you can see here I don't know what the time is I think it's like half past seven and another day of solo parenting is successfully completed. Both children alive, well, happy, fed and washed in bed. I think that is a big tick on the parenting box. You don't have to do exciting things for it to be a good day. We did nothing exciting today. We literally like, yeah, went to shop. <laughs> but you don't have to do something crazy every day. So yeah, I am going to watch 
an episode of Grey's Anatomy because I am binging, binging Grey's Anatomy at the moment. So I'm going to watch an episode of that. I'm going to have something to eat. I think I'll cook some pasta. And I'm going to go to bed and I'm going to have a really early night. I'm still hanging <laughs> from the wedding like two nights ago. I just can't handle it anymore. I'm old. So I definitely want an early night. But thank you so much for watching my mummy vlog today. Don't forget that I have linked Italo jewellery in my description box below for you to have a little look-see. And I will see you lovely people in my next video.